Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create a QR code in Canva in 2023. So we're exploring a practical skill that's going to enhance your marketing efforts. How to create a QR code, of course. So if you're ready to incorporate QR codes in your designs, stick around and I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of creating the QR code post or whatever it is in Canva in 2023. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First of all, we will have to go and access your Canva account. To do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use a Brave browser and of course in your case it could be any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, basically just go here, type Canva dot com hit the enter button and this should take you into the home screen or main screen of canva so now if you don't know nothing about canva of course you can scroll down and read more information about this example to just familiarize or just to have a general idea about it and of course there are some plans for it so there's canva free comes with that canva pro comes with that and canva for teams of course if you want to so if you have an account go to the top right corner click on login to login into your account and if you don't have an account you can simply click on sign up to create a new account for your own or here in the middle which is sign up for free so for me i'll just go login i'll log in with a google account for you just go and create an account or login depends on your situation so here is it we are logged in of course i am on the free plan if you want to get better stuff you will have to go you can try it for uh, 30 days as you can see then you'll have to go and start paying and they will remind you seven days before even your trial ends. So you don't have or you don't pay by mistake if you didn't like it. So in here, once we do so, we'll have to, of course, once all you are in Canva, you'll have to go and create a new design. You can go simply and click on create a design here at the top right corner. Go and click on that. Once you click on it, you'll have to choose whatever you want to uh, create. You want to create a doc, whiteboard, presentation, Instagram post, resume, poster, flyer, logo, video, or document. Or you can simply start with custom size, or you can import a file, or you can choose something, I don't know, from your media if you have to. So let's just go with this example. If you click on custom size, you'll have to choose the width and height with pixels, inch, millimeters, or centimeters, whatever suits you. So for me, I'll just go here in example and let's say we want to create logo. So go to the logo and as you can see, I'll be taken right here. Now, you can, of course, for you, if you selected your custom dimensions or used your predefined like templates, depending on where you plan to use the QR code as an example. For me, I'll just use the logo. For you, if it's a post, make sure to, I don't know. So it depends on you. Now you'll have to go navigate to the Elements tab on the left bar. As you can see here on the left, simply go and click on this Elements tab. This will take you in here. In the search bar, type QR code. QR code. As simple as that. Go and hit that. And as you can see, you'll be able now to use this app to create colorful QR codes for yourself. So simply go and click on install app and open and as you can see you'll have to add the url which will create a qr code for you and to your design people can scan the qr code to reach the url so for me as an example i'll just add like the url i'll just have https two dot two slashes i'll just take them to facebook.com why not or to canva.com why not Canva.com and click on generate code as simple as that as you can see they generate the qr code for me of course i can make it bigger smaller however i want for me i choose the logo as a dimension so i'll choose like a full size uh, logo as qr code as an example i'll just go here open new tab and type qr code scanner as an example, QR code scanner, and we'll take this QR code to test it out. It's going to take us to canva.com. So go in here, and so 
Okay, this will use my camera and pictures just to test everything out. See, you can simply just go and drop the image in here. Okay, so it should be an image for me. So I can get just come here, pictures, and here I'll find this QR code and click on scan now. And as you can see, the scan data will be the canva.com. So if you scan the QR code with your phone, it will take you right here without any problem. So now, once you add your custom code, for you as an example, if it's not a logo, you can simply put it if it's a post, just design your posts and leave it here at the bottom right, bottom left, top right, top left. Make sure that the whole QR code is included. Make sure to not have it like that or like that even like that so make sure to have it all included just in case so you don't have any problem in the uh, in the future and of course you can even customize its appearance change the color add a logo or adjust the size to suit your design be mindful not to compromise the scannability of the qr code of course you if you double click as example on this qr code this will only take you here as example you change your design etc if you double click on this QR code and click on this you can even download this selection if you want to have it alone or as an example just click on it once or normally when you double click it should show here but it's fine just go here back to the QR code and as you can see you'll find this right there you can of course now as, as we said before just customize this however you want the background color the foreground color as an example I don't know just make it blue why not and click on updates code and as you can see it will show right here so basically just edit the appearance of it to match your design that you have of your post or whatever you're creating on canva then as we said before you'll be able to download this section once you finish everything with it or you can once you finish everything just go and share this stuff the whole like uh, style download it or share it on social media or even as you can see more you can copy the link i don't know you can do a lot with it that's no canva stuff of course you can test your code again as an example test this new image and with your phone with whatever you want i can try it with my phone but you will not be able to see me that's why i try it with the website that i showed you before and yeah i guess that's it so for you congratulations you've successfully like learned how to create a qr code in canva so thank you for joining me today and QR code, of course, is a first title tools in marketing. So get creative and incorporate them into your designs. So if you like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe to our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one. And I'll see you in the next video.